sure, whatever. Do whatever you want. L literally, this card reads, literally do whatever you want. Fimoru with Maxi Ash, Shangri-La, shangri and Wanted, Seeker of Sinful Spoils. 40 cards with our opponent, 60. Let's do it up, we're going first. Start off with the Wanted. All right, we do have the Ash Blossom. It's such a cool, fun thing that Yu-Gi-Oh does. Isn't it so fun that we just like, just both hand, we just start at four cards. The both opponents are gonna just start at four cards, who cares? All right, Diabelle set. I'm gonna set the Sinful Spoils, gonna activate. You, 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 you're on this too, what? So you're just on the whole thing. Oh, okay, yeah, whatever. Snake Eye Ash, summon Poplar, Poplar summon itself off of its own effect. I'm sorry, Ash Search It. Uh, wanted, uh, sent, put the Sinful Spoils, draw. Flamberge, special summon here. Poplar, put itself in the back row. Flamberge, put the Ash in the back row and pass turn. Okay. We'll go Flamberge here, target um, Ash. Oh my God. Wow, that's Twin Twister. Twin Twister in the year of our Lord, 2024. That's crazy. Leerless. Okay, Barrel Canary. We do the Maxi does resolve. We go Wagtail, grab Bird Call. It did work. I'm not gonna lie to you, it worked. Starling here. What? <laughs> what are you doing here? <laughs> okay. Okay, okay, I'm in, I'm in. All right, summon both birds. We're gonna go Turquoise Warbler, summon back. Now we're gonna get these into the Assembled Nightingale. Now we're gonna get these into another Starling. Starling's going to add us another card from our deck, Target. We're gonna go shangri here. They're gonna go Assembled, so all their stuff cannot be destroyed by card effects or battle. We're gonna go Lady on three. And then we're going to still be on Toby on four. Man, Maxi with Labyrinth is so ridiculous. You have so many of your cards online. You get to set. You get to activate Lady. You get to set cards. You can, uh, you can, act, you can even go Ku Clock to add more interruption. It's unreal. They're going to go Battle Phase here. Walk in. That's a lot of damage. And then 800 for one more. Not enough there. 200 off. It was Snake Eye the whole time. What? <laughs> Are you serious? Summon Oak and then Sinful. All right, we'll grab Barrel Clinary, but we already did it this turn, so. Wagtail here, attach. Wait, why didn't you do that before? You freaking fool. Wouldn't that have won that in the game? Yeah, they had lethal. All right, whatever. <laughs> F-Zero. Oh, oh, you really were cooking, huh? Oh, you really were cooking. Oh, you were cooking something fierce. Something stinky. Okay, just give give me your guy. It's mine. Anyway, Curry Kara. Goodbye. <laughs> Shut up. Stop. Stop it. Stop. 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 <laughs> Zeus. Go big welcome. Lady set. No! <laughs> no! No, you're not! No, I hate you! You're, so <laughs> you're gonna add this back. Go call by on the oak. What? Okay, fine. Now we can still be Torby, send the max. Set our sales build welcome. End phase. No. Okay, we'll go Flamberge, target the uh, uh, Poplar here. Okay. They'll go the... Okay, we're going to activate our Soul Energy Max. They're going to go Cobalt Sparrow. Soul Energy Max is going to add us Obelisk. It's going to normal summon it. <laughs> and then on resolution, Flamberge comes back, summons two. And then we're going to flip Soul Energy Max. <laughs> stop, 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 stop. <laughs> Boom, 4,000 damage, Poplar, 
And then the Shangrelier. Oh my god. This deck is so stupid. Ku Clock activated its effect. And now we have Imperm online. Okay. Go big welcome. Put this guy back to hand. Where art thou at Curry Kara? That's pretty horrifying. We'll go Zeus here, send everything, might as well. <laughs> Shangrelier, set a card. Set up. You have set up. Ku Clock, summon itself back. Curry Kara summon uh, for 3,000. Pass turn, they're gonna summon back. No! The Opalisk! <laughs> Such a funny sequence of events right there. That was so good. <laughs> Oh my god, thank you. That was so good. Holy guacamole. Alright, we got three M's. Three M's with Despian Tragedy, Mercurier, Sarnier, Abyssal, True Swarm, and Reasoning. Okay, 60 cards as our opponent's 45. Okay. Make the code howdy. It's not a bad idea. Oh, start off with Long End. Dump the Protoss. We'll go Drew Swarm. Banishing the Protoss. They're gonna make Chishing. Oh, good, good thing you did it now. Holy shit. Uh, it's crazy how much Drew Swarm challenges a Sword Soul board. Because every time I see Drew Swarm, I'm like, oh, Christ. You know what would have been heads up? A heads up play there would have been to make Basha. If they make Basha here, uh, spin the Drew Swarm, and then Taya dump Moye, they can go Basha, pop itself, summon the Moye, and reveal in hand to make a Chi Xiao. We'll draw a card though off the Chi Xing. Uh, I'll go Chi Xiao add, and then we're gonna go Taya dump. This is still like fine, like I get it, but uh, it would have been fun. Can I grab the blackout? Pass turn. Yeah, see, like this this is a rough one. Because now we uh, get challenged by this true swarm. Because now we're gonna synchro. Gonna make the Chaos Angel off of the Mercurier. Oh my. We'll go Drew Swarm target. They'll go Chi Xing banish here. It does get banished. Drew Swarm sends the Chi Xiao. Chaos Angel does banish. I feel like um you should have negated it and kept Chi Xing, but they go reasoning. We're gonna go they're gonna go Ash. We're gonna go cross out designator. Banishing the Ash, we get to negate the Ash here. Our reasoning does resolve. They have to call a number, they called four. Four is safe. <laughs> Summoning Albion is so funny. This guy never gets summoned. All right, we'll summon Beastial Sarnier. I'm gonna trigger the Mercurier, go grab Cartesia. Oh my God, Droll and Cockbird. All right, well, at least we know Maxi. No Maxi. Grand Gwignol here. I think this is Gwignol Turbo, really. Uh, I guess if we send Albion, we can set Branded Opening. No, Branded uh, branded in Red, too. Visceal Lubellion, pretty good. I'm going to send the Titanic Clad here. Tribute the Albion, summon the Visceal Lubellion. Now we go Visceal Lubellion. Uh, we're going to set Regained. Battle Phase, hit for 50. Albion here triggers, sending Judgment of the Branded. Wow, I have not seen this card forever. Set itself. going to go Titanic Clad at end step, summoning the Quem. Because it is a Dogmatica card. Grabbing the Cartesia at end step. So what does this card do? Target on level 8 or higher fusion monster you control. Destroy all monsters your opponent controls with an equal or higher attack than that monster. This card is in the graveyard because it's sent there to activate the effect of Fallen Albus this turn. You can set it. Oh, I see. What a good droll. That that droll did, did stop, you know, not a lot. <laughs> we get to summon back the Druus Worm. God, I hate regained... So much. Oh my god. I'm gonna go Taya here. Banish. Now, if we can somehow get rid of this Drew Swarm, we can do some really nice stuff here. Gonna summon the Bishada. We'll go Gwignol now. 
Summoning Lulu while Lilith. We're going to go regain. Put back the fusion. Draw. Danglong. Oh, my God. You're on Danglong, huh? Danglong one Taya two. We'll go Lala, uh, Lulu while Lilith. Uh, it stopped one regain draw? That's true, actually. Quem summon Albaz. Oh my god. Taya dumps the Moye. We go to Denglong. Negated. Why was it negated? I don't know why what, but... Oh, probably while Lilith negated it, yeah. Go Blackout here on the Albaz. That does stop him. Well. Denglong sending the... Oh, you're really cooking, huh? Oh, you're really cooking. The Oto, the Tutu, the Toto. Grab Taya. Some of the Via Taya Synchro to make Chow Fung. Deng Long summon Suwani. Oh my god. Making Basha. That's two spins. All right. Why wouldn't you spin the Druus word? To trigger the Chow Fung here. Summoning the Ashna. Walk over, they're gonna spin. We get to send a guy to the graveyard. Swing the Chow Fang. Basha here, target the Ashna, summon back the Taya. Why would you do that? Alright, whatever. I feel like you should make Monk there so that you can actually activate Ashna. Whatever. I'm not the one playing. Brandon High Spirits sending Albion and uh, uh, Red Albion. Grabbing Cartesia, Cartesia effect. So in itself, we get to fuse off with the Jespian Tragedy in hand. It feels so good. Summoning a Mr. Gwignol himself. We get to trigger the Tragedy here. Gwignol on two. Sending Bissia Lubellion. Grab Quem. Send the Quem. Quem effect. Send a Fallen of Alabaz. We can send Retribution. Retribution is so dumb. Yeah. <laughs> you, you really are trying. You really are trying to do this. Okay, we sent it. Summon Albion. Summon the... Bestial Luvalian. Bestial Luvalian effect. Setting, uh, activating the regain from deck. We're going to make the zombie vampire. There's no way you have an Xyz in this deck. Oh my god. What is this? Summon back the Magnumut. Oh my god. <laughs> Everyone is cooking today. Everyone is cooking out of their dang mind. God, you guys will not stop chefing it up. Okay, we got Silver723 with Kuklok, Ariane, Phantasme, Crossout, and Darumakan. We're going second. 42 cards versus our opponent's 40. Snake Eye Ash, okay. Grabbing the Poplar. Hey, Poplar. Poplar effect, summon Poplar. Poplar. Look at how cute this little Poplar is. Okay. Hey, Pablo. Make the Link Rebo. I'm going to set the Flamberge off of the uh, Field Spell. Equip, or uh, put the Poplar in the back row, and the Link Rebo, some of the Oak, Oak Effect here. Target. Some back. Now we're going to go Oak Effect, send them both. Flamberge. Link off for IP. Pretty normal. Okay. Sending the Oak here to summon the Dia Bell Star. Geez, we can get out everything we want, huh? We're gonna go set Sinful Spoils. Setting the Sinful Spoils for Snake Eye. Now I'm gonna activate the Sinful Snake Eye. Sending the uh, uh, <coughs> Dia Bell. Making Formula. Formula draw. I'm gonna go Jet here. Yeah, this Phantasm is gonna go hard. Linking off the Jet for Promethean Princess. Ah. Time to Phantasmic. <laughs> Sometimes you are just better. You are better than your opponent. Ku Clock, Neeb, Nibiru, Maxi. Okay, Shangrilear here. Whoa. You're a genius! You're a genius! You're a genius! You're a genius! You're so sick with it! You're so freaking sick with it! You are absolutely a genius! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, 
It's so good. <laughs> as soon as he said the new viewer, I was like, you are the smartest player alive. You're actually insane. You are the most cracked person ever. Oh my God. Did Flamberge also miss timing? Ah, uh, oh my, I, I, if I got cooked this so hard, I would uninstall. I'd shut down my computer. I would have punched my monitor. I would, it's over, it's over. <laughs> No, don't make me look at this. No, no, <laughs> it's the twink. No, I don't want to see. I don't want to do it. I don't want to see it. No, 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 no. Amazement, abomination, Arlequino. This is when MBT gets really mad. I'm not kissing him. Lady Labyrinth, Amaze Attraction, Cyclo Coaster. Amazing attraction, Viking Vortex, and big freaking welcome. 43 cards with our opponent's 40. You guys have history? Don't talk. I don't want to talk about it. Your angle or your devil? Oh, okay, versus Plunder Patrol. All right, Plunder, pitch the golden hair, grab the black eyes, the Plunder Patrol Sea Guide. Golden hair, peer. <laughs> Ghastly glitch. There's no way this is good. That's awesome. Please be good. This is the funniest tech ever. Lab plunder. I don't even think it's plunder. All the plunders are fiends, and you plus off of sending them to the graveyard. So it makes sense as just like a good pop, but I don't know. All right, we're going to the lady. I'm going to go uh, Mr. Man and his Mr.'s Man. What is this? Uh, Bluebeard. Then go Blackbeard here. Oh, not from deck. Oh, I guess that's true. Never mind. I'm going to go Amaze Attraction Viking Vortex. Then we'll go Lady on Chainlink 2. Lady set Daruma Cannon. Person's list is wild, I bet. All right, there's the Arlequino. Arlequino's insane. It's like actually one good card. We're gonna banish Arlequino, but we are going to put it back to hand. Then we're gonna go big welcome and return the Arlequino to hand. You're cracked. You're actually cracked. You're insane. Put it back. Whoop. Doesn't get banished. This guy goes back to hand, and Moark goes away. Now we have to go lovely here, pop a card in hand. You pop the second Ghastly Glitch, and it's Royal. They're playing two. All right, Summon and Synchro. Gonna make Bran here, okay. Summon Redbeard, Bran effect. Pop the Spell Trap, pretty good. Bran is so good. It's crazy how good Bran is just by being a Spell Trap removal card. Fiendish Rhino. <laughs> this plunder list is insane. This plunder list is nutty. It's so good. Oh my god. Big welcome. Put that guy back. We'll go lovely. Target. We'll go infinite impermanence here. They get to chain lady here because the trap card is activated. I'm so sorry. It's crazy how much lady gets to plus off of uh, people using imperm. It searches glitch. That's awesome. That's so funny. An Archfiend card. That's awesome. Now we get to activate Arlequino because the track card was activated. I'm going to go Morik. Morik. Banishing the lovely. And they're going to grab the spell. They're going to grab the shipyard. We're going to summon the Arlequino here. Use your imagination. Watch out for my trap card. Arlequino. Target. Equip the Amazement Traction, a Cyclo Coaster. We're going to grab Comica, sending it to the graveyard. Now we're going to go Standby Main. Summon the Comica, Comica effect. We're going to set an Attraction Trap, trap set, uh, set an Attraction Trap directly from deck. We're going to go Arlequino, uh, Nightmare Arlequino Summon, Abomination. Now we get to go Arlequino here, Banish 2, Pop 2, Blow Up the Board. Pretty much Axis Go Talker for the deck. Diabolica 2, oh my god. That's so good. It's the unknown. <laughs> all right. All right. It's cool. God dang it. These lists felt so insane. I felt like I was I was going sicko mode. I want both lists. Luke Von Karma's videos are usually filmed before a live studio audience. Consider clicking subscribe down below. And if you want to catch us live, head to twitch.tv slash Luke Von Karma and follow me there. Thanks for watching.